So <laughs> Nancy Pelosi still in Asia? I guess Has even she now. Not back yet? Wow. I mean, just stay at this point. <clears throat> quite honestly, I'm good with yeah, that. I'd, that'd be fine with me. Now she did say though that the House is going to vote by the end of this week on that uh, tax and spend plan. Mm-hmm. So she's got to be back by then, right? I guess, although really in reality, you wouldn't have to. You could vote on the internet, except I don't think they do that, but they could. I wish they would. And that's how they would stay in their own mm-hmm. in their own districts. Make it hard for lobbyists. Make them go yes. get, go to your district. Yes. Uh, but yeah, she was. Uh, I I don't know where this was, but she <clears throat> had some kind, very heartfelt things to say about China. No, oh, good. It was good to see. When I was a little girl. I was told at the beach, if I dug a hole deep enough, we would reach China. So we've always felt a con- connection there. Oh, my gosh. You didn't really say that. <laughs> when I was a little girl. Oh, my gosh. I was told at the beach, if I dug a hole deep enough, we would reach China. So we've always felt a con- connection there. That's your connection to China. Because... <laughs> When you were playing in the sandbox, somebody <laughs> you dig a hole deep enough, well, you'll beach. go all the way to China. At the beach. It's not yeah. going to work in a sandbox. Don't <laughs> don't try to spin this. It would work at a beach, Pat. I I mean, this is the same woman This who's... is the caliber of people we have in office. Mm-hmm. Speaker of the House. <sighs> wow. Number three in line for the presidency of the United States. That is crazy. No one, no one in the top three is fit for office. Never That's mind, sure. Never mind the presidency. Right. But... Um, She's the same lady who said in 2008, you mm. know, Chairman Bernanke, you know, said, <laughs> what was the clip where she says, uh, I don't know what, he says it's the worst uh, it could be since the Great Depression. Oh, I, don't, I don't know what was so great about it. But that's what they call it. <laughs> Ugh. Uh, the utter stupidity of these people. Yeah. <sighs> Hard to believe. That we've elected people this stupid uh-huh. to lead our government uh-huh. in the most powerful nation in the history of the world. And we've got buffoons like this in charge. Yeah. Two of the top three positions, Kamala and Nancy, <laughs> we can thank the great state of California for. I was always told growing up that if hmm. when I was at the beach, okay. if I dug a hole deep enough... I'd go all the way to China. And so that's a pretty powerful mm. connection. That's been my powerful connection to it. Because <clears throat> yeah. I know at any time, I can go to the beach and I can dig my way into China if yeah. I want to. Yeah. See, <clears throat> there's a lot of castles here in Great Britain. And when I was a kid at the beach growing up, I'd mm-hmm. make sand castles. So I've always mm. felt a connection to the, the royal family. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> I, I swear. I mean, it's just we are in bizarro world central. Yeah, there's no doubt about that. Jeez. Uh, All right, well. (laughs) Number three in command. That's great. Speaker of the House, Nancy Pelosi, everybody.